Rewrite 18 squared minus 11 squared as a product of a sum and a difference, then simplify. Okay, so as a product of sum and a difference, here's what you do. 18 plus 11 times 18 minus 11. Okay, and this is the exact same equivalent. And what you could do to verify that if you wanted to is you could go ahead and multiply this out. You could do 18 times 18 and then 18 times negative 11, so on and so forth, and see what you get. In fact, let me get, go ahead and do that. 18 times 18 is 18 squared. 18 times negative 11 and then plus 11 times 18 for this one the inside and then for the last it's going to be minus 11 times 11 or 11 squared so let me clean this up and give it the same notation 18 squared and then 18 times negative 11 and 18 times positive 11 is what we have here those will actually cancel out Let's see what is 18 times 11 so we're going to have negative 198 here then plus 198 here and then minus 11 squared here so the minus 198 plus 198, that makes zero. So you're left with 18 squared minus 11 squared like that. So see, we're back where we started. That's how you know this product of a sum and a difference works. Okay, so now let's go back to our 18 minus 11, or plus 11 rather, and 18 minus 11, the product of sum and a difference. So instead of using the FOIL method and taking us right back to where we started. Let's actually do the sum in the middle and see what happens. We have 18 plus 11 is 29, and then 18 minus 11 is 7. So really, this 18 squared minus 11 squared is the same as 29 times 7. So you can multiply it out from there. 2 times 7 is 20 times 7 is 140, and then 9 times 7 is 63. So we're going to add. We're going to get 203. All right, so let's go ahead and review. Rewrite 18 squared minus 11 squared as a product of a sum and a difference. So we made it 18 plus 11 times 18 minus 11, and we verified using the FOIL method. And you don't need to verify this every time. I just wanted to do this so you can see uh, how it all works. So then we did is we came down here and we performed the sum and the difference. So we did 18 plus 11 is 29, 18 minus 11 is 7, and then we multiplied 29 times 7 to get an answer of 203. So 18 squared minus 11 squared is 203, 